Welcome to Baseball News Club. My name is Chris. Today we're going to be highlighting National League 2018 Cy Young Award winner Jacob DeGrom. And I tell you, from start to finish, this guy was flat out dominating. This former Rookie of the Year Award winner won his 2018 Cy Young by mixing a fastball, 97-98, and then he would have a slider that was in the low 90s, high 80s, and then just for fun he'd throw in a curveball changeup just to make you look ridiculous. Quick warning for those of you at home, uh, especially the guys. And that was probably a 98 mile per hour fastball. Blue ended up being okay. He's like, I'm fine. Now Jacob was a workhorse. Here's a broken bat. He broke a lot of bats in 2018. However, he went 10 and 9. You'd have to go back to the early 80s. Fernando Valenzuela, who had 13 wins, to track a National League Cy Young Award winner with that low of wins. He actually had a 2.71 ERA in his nine losses. Want to see a sick pitch? Look at this 92 mile per hour slider dominant now this former ninth round pick out of florida he was actually ranked fifth in mvp voting and took 99 percent of the cy young award uh, voting percentage that is just flat out dominating look at that pitch against mookie betts and one of the crazy things about him is he's a power pitcher and also a very smart pitcher power let's check out his fastball and having a good fastball doesn't always do it look how he pitched to mookie outside earlier in the game and then high heat later in the game now to illustrate how he got 99% of the Cy Young vote, it didn't matter if he was home or away. It didn't matter if it was the first half of the season or second half. He still posted under 2 ERA. And then against right-handed batters, a .172 average. And I love it when the home plate umpire punches people out. He gone. Now since his Rookie of the Year award, he's been a consistent good pitcher in Major League Baseball. And no reason not to expect that for years to come. Thank you for watching Baseball News Club. Have a great day.